PMs are a part of almost all of our every day, but how do you drive them to a virtual event? Stay tuned. Hey, Flowchat fam, Chris here, CEO and co-founder of Flowchat. And today we're bringing real entrepreneurs getting real results. Uh, that's why, yes, it's true. You are crazy, but you're not alone. I'm crazy. Everyone you see on the show is, is crazy. We're creating, we're cultivating, we're providing products and service to the marketplace. And today's guest is no different. He's doing it in a really unique, interesting way. I'm intrigued to hear more about what's happening. I've just kind of seen some uh, of the results in the wave they're creating, but we're going to get to discover what's really going on together. So please help me welcome Scott. How's it going, man? Uh, fantastic, man. I appreciate you having me on today, man. <laughs> Excited to get into it. I know, I know you're like you're the Wizard of Oz behind the curtain. Uh, building all the systems and, and scheming world domination. We'll reference Pinky and the Brain today. I don't know. I haven't thought about them for a while, but like, dude, uh, I know this is on your scope. Um, let's talk about DMs to virtual events. Why why do this way of acquiring? Absolutely. I mean, I think the biggest thing is you're able to cultivate a relationship prior to if you're running a one day masterclass, a three day, a five day, um, a webinar. It really doesn't matter. You can cultivate a relationship go from completely unknown status. And by the time you actually deliver your event, you've taken them from, they don't know who you are, they don't know your brand, they don't know if you have authority or if you have anything to teach. And then they they go from nothing to no like, trust and ready to purchase. And that's what like that's why we think it's one of the most powerful tools mm. for new entrepreneurs, for entrepreneurs that have been in the game for a long time or just trying to re-engage it allows you to create and cultivate that relationship in a more personal manner, DMs, especially even over ad sets. So it's a good way of getting a much higher show rate and being able to transform lives without, you know, no one showing up. And that's the name of the game. What, what I'm hearing you say is efficiency, Scott. I'm hearing you say you can go from cold to sold in, in you know, one event, a shorter period of time because they're spending a little bit more time with you. Is that fair? Yes, I, and I would say like, if we're gonna look at a time frame to be very specific, 13 days tops. Like you're going from 13 days pre-event and then maybe 13 days post-event. However, if you're in someone's DM, especially using this software, you're able to get, typically you're able to get them on a call even prior to you. So you've started the sales process or the prospecting, the triaging, ever before they get on call. So You're aiming see your events. Yeah, exactly. Aiming for 13 plus touch points for any like pro sales process. And so some you're getting some of those touches before the event. So I hear you're saying. So um okay, this is important, but can you please define virtual event? That means so many different things to people. What when you say virtual event, what does that mean? <laughs> uh, I mean my biggest our biggest champion in the virtual event space would be a challenge. That's what we focus okay. very heavily on, um, because within a challenge, a boot camp, a retreat, you can call them everything, but they're basically the same thing. You can, in the span of let's say three or five days, completely transform somebody's mindset. Like you're actually giving them transformative value to where they can walk away and actually get benefit. But at the yeah. same time, because you're the one who's providing that value, you've you're, you're top of mind, top of list, and the most trusted advisor at that point. They heard it from from your lips, they saw your face, heard your voice. So, um, you know, it's, it's interesting going through different iterations in the market for over the last decade. I know you've, you're have you not new to business either. It's all the same stuff. Now hang with me on this. It's all the same stuff in the pattern, meaning we don't know each other exists. You get to know each other a little bit, then there's some more nurturing, and then there's uh, you know, eventually that CTA and you become more solution, you know, product aware. You're going through Eugene Schwartz's, you know, buyer journey, he outlines it well. Right. Um, but he, but here's why this is important, I, th I felt to talk about today. Because anyone listening, watching, we're grateful for your time and attention as we value our own. And it's important to pick up on the trends as the market perceives it. 
And so what you're describing, Scott, I'm seeing a pivot as well. There's some, some larger influencers, they're doing the same thing. The mechanics don't change, but the jargon and how you're acquiring, there's these little intricacies that if you, if you really pay attention to and you nail them, it equals more sales for equal or less effort. Uh, Cause you have a good system that just works. You know what's frustrating, Scott? Spending time and money and not having a return for it. I gotta tell you, probably one of my top least favorite things. <laughs> I'm assuming everyone listening, watching is on the same page. So I appreciate you coming out and sharing more. Let's let's take it just a little step deeper, go a little more granular here. Um, you you said a challenge. Is this three days? Five? What, what's the amount of days that you're doing in your challenge? I mean, we set it up and our we set up even our software suite. Um, for our clientele and even for ourselves, because we, we use exactly what we help our clients with, is it could be three or five days. And okay. we see that it kind of depends on what type of information you're putting you're putting down. Five days, in our opinion, typically has a higher sale rate to a larger number because you can offer incredible transformation over the course of five days. Yeah. Now, I will say a caution, like where most people, if they're listening to this, are going to say, ah, I've done a challenge. I've done a webinar. I'm, a, I'm actually one of stuff. those people, Scott. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right. This is great. Like, it, Talk to me. <laughs> it doesn't work. It doesn't work for me. It doesn't work. Well, like what you said in the trends of the market, who are some of the biggest players you'll see out there who are running uh, basically evergreen challenges 24 seven. You got the Russell Brunson's. Yeah. You got the yeah. Cardones. Uh, like every day there's a challenge. However, what they do and where we focus more is like, especially on the tech follow-up and just introduction side. Yeah. Um, and even more important where most people drop the ball is the process to generate the sell. Yeah. And what I, what I mean by that is cool. You, you might be out offering huge value to somebody over the course of maybe if it's a four hour class or a five day event, but are you giving them the right mindset to want to purchase from you? And are you phrasing and setting up your event to where you can have 10 people on that event and you turn it into a group sales call? Or you have 100 people on the event and it takes you no more time and you're still able to generate massive return because you've set up the buyer pattern interrupt or whatever the our, you know, clever sales guys come up with to where someone walks in and goes, there's no way I could walk out of here without using their services. Like, yeah. It would be just dumb luck. I, I couldn't do it to myself. So even knowing the system and the process and the, the automation, and that's where we really try to take the tech portion out of everything we do, whether or not it's with FlowChat or with our smart marketing AI, where automation's galore. So mm -hmm. it's all templatized and you just plug in information once and everything launches. You don't have to build a funnel. You don't have to do crazy stuff. But then yeah. be able to implement that and really drive from cold to hot in the course of 13 days or less. That's huge. That's a huge point as it pertains to ongoing execution. A lot of people will execute on a challenge and be like, and, and I'm totally in this bucket, unfortunately. I'm like, oh my gosh, that was an insane amount of work. How about I'm probably not never going to do this again. I've done we, we, myself and, and business partners. We did one challenge and haven't done one since this years ago. Okay. But here's the thing. It's like building a house. It's like moving into a house. Yeah, the move is annoying, but then you're in the cool house and then you go, you know, leave, do something else, whatever you come back, you come back to the house. You don't have to reorganize it and put everything back. Like it's already built. It's a lot easier. You get that leverage with the systems. And I want to, I want to get the systems with you in a second, but what I heard you say is five days. So you're like, Hey, we kind of like the five day challenge, uh, implementing there. We're giving value. Are those like hour sessions? Are you going live? Are there, you know, replays? And then you're, you have like email campaigns going for all these. So we do a combination where it's either going to be between an hour to three hours, depending on how in depth we want to go. One because, to three hours. Awesome. And, and I say that it just depends on how deep we want to get into someone's like for instance uh, we're going to do an offer creation challenge we're going to spend two hours going into here's exactly how you build out your offer and here's exactly the market you need to be targeting do you understand or what else can we provide to make sure it's like light bulb moment Bing. right yeah uh, and then then all of a sudden that's like oh instant transformation for that prospect or the person in your challenge and they walked away from let's just say that's day one 
they're like, these guys are good. Like I have ultra clarity on what I need to do now. So yeah. what's the next step? And in the background with our, with automation, and then we'll talk about that later, but we run gamification past it. Let's talk about that for a second. So we use a, yeah. a point based, yeah, point based system to where people are interacting via their cell phone to like, like we're saying, here's your homework for the day. Once you're done, I need you to do these two things. I need you to go into this area, make a post or do whatever. And also I need you to text this number back saying step one complete. And boom, you just got three points and there's a leaderboard out there. Oh, um, that's so, cool. And then, and with that, the, like a great way to use that is like, hey, whoever's the lead, the point leader at X point in the challenge or the boot camp or whatever, we're gonna give you something free. We're gonna give you something of extra value um, that you don't want to miss, type thing. How do you automate that? Uh, we use like our system in Smart Marketing AI where everything's pre-built and pre-generated for a client, so mm -hmm. they get it right out of the box. Um, so not only are you to, doing this challenge, but you're helping other people with with like the back end systems to run this challenge. Yes, what we do is literally just give you all of our software like hey this is what we are doing this is what we're currently doing or this is what is working all you have to do is answer a couple questions on the back end of the system and it's going to pre-generate over 450 workflows including your <laughs> follow-up sequences your intro your gamification Holy and cow. it's going to build you a slick little funnel so that way you can have the landing pages to get people to go from uh, hey, I'm just getting, I'm just checking this out to I'm registering, to I'm getting follow-up sequencing, I'm getting emails to show up to an application call. Everything's just automatically built. And all you have to do is fill out one document and then you're ready to launch your challenge in less than 10 to 14 days. Um, it's, and then as you mentioned, it's just like having a house. If you're like, great, that challenge worked great. I just want to run one again next month on this date. You just simply change the dates in the back end of the software and then your entire system's ready to go. Ladies and gentlemen, Scott is rivaling Little Caesars right now with his hot and ready challenge software. And and when you're if you're hearing software and you're like, nah, don't, because really what he's saying is processes and systems where you hit buttons, there's, uh, did you say 450 workflows, like different texts and emails? And is that what it, that's, oh my yeah. gosh. <laughs> that so is yeah, insane. Like if someone were to like, someone clicks the go button, um, which is literally a click of a button, then all, we have over 450 automations pre-built, pre-selected, and they're gonna be automatically updated to your content or to your copy, to your flow by just filling out one doc. So. It kind of is the hot and ready, I guess you could say, of um, software. It's um, not only that, like the one thing we really know is people hate tech. Uh, I hate tech, um, but I but know- they love results. It is and, <laughs> and they love results. And so I, I've never seen a quicker, a quicker way to either start your business or to generate massive return off your ROI and time than using the combination of like Flowchat and then a combination of all your marketing tools in one place to where, boom, you're able to generate 60 to 90 brand new contacts every single day. And you have a very specific value add you're sending them to. You're like building your people. list. You're building trust and authority. Uh, it leads to more referral. Like this is insane. Scott, there's people leaning in, listening, watching this right now. Where do they find you? Uh, they can either find me just on my profile on Facebook, if they really want to, Scott can can, or more importantly, it's not just me out there. I got a, I got four boys in the band that we all work with and we all focus on very specific aspects of uh, different key metrics of business. So our group, Growing Entrepreneur, we have a Facebook group and I see the link scrolling constantly in the background, so that's awesome. Yep, check um, out Facebook doc, yep, keep going. I was gonna say, you can hop in there and ask any question you want. Um, <laughs> like reach out to us directly and I mean, or me directly, and we're more than happy to even just do an audit of what you got, right? Uh, we don't charge for that. We just wanna see how we can add extreme value into what you're already doing. So if you were, wanted to increase your sales in the next 13 days, let us know. I mean, <laughs> that's kinda where it comes down to, right? 
Scott, you're a badass. Thanks for being you. And and with the, uh, I'm glad the band got back together as well. <laughs> so you guys are crushing over yeah. there. Uh, and, and sharing with the audience. That's why I wanted to bring you out. You're doing uh, some things that are worth talking about and worth sharing. Uh, anything else you'd like to share for today? Uh, uh, I would just say, you know, we're here to help people. Um, again, we do have costs, our, our services that do cost money. However, our services to help you to send you in the right direction are completely free. So we're not going to charge you just to say, hey, I think you should focus on an offer creation or you should focus on media buying because that's the stage you're at in business. We just want to see where you're at, pointing in the right direction and say, good luck. We hope you make the most amount of money and that you have a successful business. Dude, you nailed it. And hey, I thank you everyone uh, for your time and attention. As always, value it, value it greatly. Uh, this is the place where real entrepreneurs are getting real results on the front lines. Today we got to talk about virtual events and how they pertain uh, with DMs in the event, yet like with challenges. This is a viable, uh, really strong way to acquire in today's market. Uh, hopefully it's one that uh, you can consider and get some great results for yourself. Hey, we'll see you next time with more great entrepreneurs. All right, take care.